Hi, this is Mike, and today I'm going to show you how to use the standard cost update utility for Job Boss. This lets you update in a bulk or batch mode the material items that are in a Job Boss database. Instead of going into the form and searching for each material item one at a time, updating the cost and then hitting save, you can bring them all into this programmed Excel spreadsheet by hitting the load materials with existing standard cost button. And depending on the size of your database, this can take a minute, but it will pull in whatever database you last logged into uh, when you were in Job Boss. Here we're working with the standard training database, and we're bringing in all the parts. And the way this works is you basically just say, hey, I'm going to change this part to a price of $45, and maybe this one to 20 And you'd go down the line, and you have this column C, so you can always see your existing standard cost as you're working with the new standard costs. Over in D for reference, you have the type finish good, hardware, etc. Once you do this, your next step is really just to update the materials. Say yes. And you will get a highlight of the parts that were updated. And to kind of prove this worked, if we look at the line items 6 here and 14, I'm going to clear the data and then reload it. And now you can see the existing standard cost that pulled out of the database is indeed 45 and 20. So these are the costs that were written into the Job Boss database when we hit the update materials. And that's all there is to it. If you were to want to work with just a select group of parts that maybe you had been working with previously, I'll cut and paste some parts here. You can again clear the database, or clear the uh, spreadsheet rather and maybe you were working with these parts you can then use the column C and D update current value button to bring in the existing and the type since you wouldn't normally have those when you cut and paste and again we can say I'm going to make the prices whatever we want them to be we would hit update we would say yes and again to reload that we can reload and we see that the existing standard costs have been updated and again we can prove this by going into job boss and looking these up and again this works the same for selling price update as well we have another spreadsheet that handles that concept is the same again very simple three to four step operation here load the materials automatically all of them or cut and paste the materials you're working within and update your pricing and you're good to go